Hello everyone, this is Ross here for XGR and today we're taking a look at Bus Simulator. This releases on consoles on the 17th of September 2019. Right, we're taking a first look at it today, so let's uh, crack on. So company, uh, new company, enter a name, let's just go for, uh, let's go for XGR and make it sound a bit bussified, so let's go for Express. There we go. Uh, sandbox mode on or off is greyed out. Uh, enable bankruptcy, yeah we'll have that on. Trip mode simplified, we'll leave it as it is. Press Y to create. Right, next we get to create our driver, so it could be male or female. Uh, it's two different uniforms. Let's go for the tie, primary colour, secondary colour. Let's have a quick look. Um, I like the orange shirt, we'll keep the orange shirt. Secondary colour, we'll go for grey trousers. And tertiary, so that's going to be the tie colour. Let's make that grey as well. Hair colour, we'll leave black, skin tone. Um, let's have a quick look through those. Okay, so let's just go for three. Press Y to finish. And it's asking us if we want to play the tutorial, so yes we will. Over here. I'm glad to see you again. I hope the traffic wasn't too nasty. Anyway, look at this sweet Mercedes Citaro K. It's straight off the lot over in Sunny Springs. Of course, it's a smaller model, but I'm sure everyone in town will be hopping onto this bus and our little project in no time. Right, so let's open the front door by interacting with the door button on the front of the bus. Ah, uh -huh, there we go. Let's press A. That's going to sit on the driver's seat. Great. I'll just take a seat over there while you make yourself comfortable in the driver's seat. Right, so we can click the left stick in to change to third person mode. Okay. Let's take your back. time to familiarize yourself with the controls. Don't forget to close the doors. And remember to turn on the lights. Okay, so cockpit zoom, press up on the D-pad. Open the action menu. Close the action menu, okay. Start the ignition by pressing the indicated cockpit button or the shown button. Oh, how do I get uh, ignition? Have to do it again? There we go. Let's zoom out of there again. Right, turn on the headlights by pressing the indicated cockpit button or the shown button two times. Alright, well we'll do it from the cockpit. There we go. Turn on all the bus lights. That's these over here. Right, close the doors with X. Are you ready to bring public transport back to Seaside Valley? Great! Then release the parking brake and let's head for the exit. Right, so we press down. There we go. And right trigger to go. And left trigger's brake. Oh, before I forget, I've got a little surprise for you. Just follow the route on the GPS. And there's a the GPS. We've also got it on the screen as well, so we need to turn left. Do we have any uh, indicators? Um, indicators anywhere? Windshield wipers, far light. What about the uh, ah left and right bumper? There we go. Right, let's go. Is letting us pull out. Thank you kindly. Come on, let's go. We've got a horn. Right stick. 
You see, my predecessor okay. wasn't a fan of public transport, which is why they shut it down in the first place. In Sunny Springs, where I used to work, we collaborated closely with the local bus company, which improved the satisfaction of our residents significantly. Well, I've got the speed limit to run as well, so we don't get any uh, tickets. Got our first stop coming up as well. Oh, the first stop is coming up. You just said that. I hope you remember your training <laughs> because I've invited a couple of people along on our maiden voyage. Just park close enough to the curb and within the markings. Oh, and don't forget to use the turn signal. Okay, I will do. All right, let's get around this corner. Go. Next stop, Victory Road. Open the doors. Hello, everybody. Good morning, Miss Tannhauser. Glad you could make it. Hello, Mira. Thank you for inviting me. Hey, Sam. How's your daughter? Thanks, Mira. She's been really busy lately. Oh, she's rather lively, isn't she? Glad to have you here. Everybody, please take a seat. We'll be departing shortly. Right, that's that one. Now, this is the hard part. Do you see that clock? Do you think you can make it to the next stop in time? That bottom I'm left. I'm so glad Two so minutes. many people have turned up just for this little test drive. They really seem pleased with the prospect of once again having a working public transportation network. Right. Yeah, we're going to make this. There's only around the corner. Oh, around the bend. Plenty of time. It's going pretty well so far, isn't it? The next stop is right over there. Aubrey and I moved here a while back. We found a great apartment just up that street. And we've really been enjoying the neighborhood. There are a couple of great restaurants around here. Speak of the devil. May I introduce you to my fiance? Hey, honey. The neighbors asked if they could borrow our lawnmower. Sure. Send them my regards. Let's close the doors. I think we've got them all now. Did you know that this bus has a Blue Tech diesel engine? It has an output of 210 kilowatts. I did a lot of research before we decided on this model. Alright, so we're going to be making a left turn over the bridge. Let's get into that lane. I really love to walk this promenade in the summer. You always have a light breeze, and the trees offer some shade, and the river's close by if it gets too hot. Come on, let's get a move on. Right. There we go.
so, so far, so good. Uh, the mirrors are a tiny bit framey. Our next stop the is job. over there. Oh, sorry. I'm just super excited. Hello, a ticket please. Oh, this is just a test drive of sorts. But wait, it would actually be a nice opportunity to make sure the ticketing machine is working properly, wouldn't it? Okay, might enter the ticket machine. We can either click on it or we press right on the D-pad. I set the ticket duration. The passenger requests a week ticket. Okay, so week. Hey, I didn't think you'd show up. <laughs> Student. Hey, Mira. Yeah. I wasn't sure if I'd make it. One Professor ticket. Zellerman, Print. didn't expect to see you here. As if I'd missed this opportunity, my fiance already sold our car in anticipation of the return of the buses. What? Really? Right. Then let's hope this venture is a success. Can Have change? a nice day. Hello there. Could you lower the ramp for me? Sure, that's no problem. Could you lower the ramp so they can board the bus? All right, so in this one. Yeah, there we go. See that happening in the uh, right hand side mirror? There we are. Thank you so much. Having buses will make it so much easier for me to get around again. Close the doors. This is going quite well so far, isn't it? I think we can move along now. The oh. Lido is a Trucks really great out. place for Thank a bit of much. relaxing leisure time. There are nice rest areas, and for a reasonable fee, you can get a wonderful massage. Oh, there are that? even a couple of Pot people holes. I don't know here. Seems word has gotten around. Let's keep an eye out for those potholes then. All right, round this roundabout. Go. I will uh kind of move almost his traffic shifts. Come on. Oh, don't stop. So the next stop is the last one. Get to indicate. Oh, this is our terminal stop. All passengers must disembark the bus here. After that, we'll drive to the garage to park the bus. To everybody who's still on board, I want to thank you for participating in this drive. With your support, we'll bring public transport back to Seaside Valley. Excuse me, can you help me get off the bus again? Oh, of course. Would you help the passenger in the wheelchair to get off the bus again? There we go. And we 
we track the ramp. I think that's everyone. The route to the garage is marked on the GPS. Let's head there and call it a day. Okay, right. We've been talking to some graphic designers to create some decals and wraps to customize our buses. Hopefully, we'll get some design submissions soon. Right, so we're going to be able to um, paint the buses up as well with them by the sounds of that. That's good. Sun shield. There's even a radio we can play if we want to. So end of this road, turn right, and the garage should just be on the right-hand side. So... Pulling out. I can wait. Nice Everything's carriage. all set up over there. Well. All in all, I think that was a rather successful maiden voyage. Wouldn't you agree? Congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> all right, let's turn the lights off. There we go. Turn off the ignition. Let me just collect my things. We've put some systems in place so you can start planning out routes and growing our little project. Let me show you real quick. Okay, I've written down a number of things we should try before we get you back out on the road. It's just to make sure the infrastructure is okay and ensure we can deliver a robust public transport system. First things first, City Hall wants us to run a pilot night line just to see how many people would use it. They'll finance an additional bus for you in return. I've already prepared a route for this and spread the word. Select the pre-existing route and drive it by night. Right, well before I do that, I'm just going to quickly, because I'm going to end the video in a second. Let's quickly go over some of this stuff. You can also play multiplayer on this. I think you can just open up your single player game to multiplayer. Uh, so you want to get your friends in, that's pretty cool. Let's have a quick look at the settings. Um, so loads of game settings here. Let's have a quick scroll through NPC. So you can turn the uh, spawn limit up and down. Alright, okay, there's loads of event frequencies as well we can have a look at. Uh, audio sliders. There's a control scheme as well. Uh, do sensitivities and stuff as well along the bottom there. Alright, so that's that. Um, bus garage, you can have a look at your buses. You can obviously employ people as well once you set routes up. Right, there you go then guys, that pretty much wraps it up for today. If you want to see more of this, don't forget to head over to our second channel, Console Sim Hub. Uh, link in the description and at the end of the video, I will have some gameplay for Bus Simulator over there within the next few days. Uh, so yeah, don't forget to go over there, subscribe and uh, wait for the videos to land for this. Uh, if you've enjoyed this video, please leave a like on it. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you soon.